Fordham University football Rams traveled to Lafayette on Saturday hoping to stay perfect on the year, but turnovers and penalties did the Rams in as they suffered their first loss of the year. Trailing 10-0 early in the second, quarterback Peter Matzold hit to Bucky Jones on back-to-back -back passes, picking up 9 on the first and 20 on the second to move the ball from the Fordham 20 to midfield. Six plays later, Matzold found Brian Wetzel with a screen pass that Wetzel turned into a 34-yard score to pull Fordham to within three, 10-7 with 10.38 left in the half. Jordan Chapman made an acrobatic interception on Lafayette's ensuing possession. And Carlton Coons seemed to have picked up 21 yards on the first play following the interception, but the play was called back by a holding penalty. After Lafayette took a 17-7 lead, the Rams threatened when Matzold hooked up with Wessel for a 42-yard gain, but two plays later, the Leopards picked off a Matzold pass to end the threat. The Rams threatened again on their final possession of the half, thanks to a 31-yard pass from Matzold to Sam Ajala, which moved the Rams into Lafayette territory. And then a 21-yard completion later in the drive to Wetzel that would have brought the Rams inside the 20, but the play was called back by a penalty. Jake Rodriguez ended Lafayette's first drive of the second half with an interception, but the Rams couldn't take advantage of the turnover, and the Fordham defense was back on the field, where DeAndre Slate was able to get his hands up in the air and deflect a pass attempt. Late in the fourth, Dan Light took a short pass from Matzold and broke a couple of tackles to gain 21 yards. And later in the drive, Matzold found Wetzel over the middle with a 13-yard scoring strike that made the final score 27-14.